Hello, and welcome back to Grandpa Games. Uh, we are starting Horizon Forbidden West. Yay! <laughs> so, without further ado, let us get into it. Uh, yes, with everything. Do you want to link your PlayStation Network to your Steam account? Oh, uh, excellent. We are now a member. Cool. So let's continue. Through a lifetime spent in the pursuit of knowledge, one question consumed me. How did our world come to be? The old ones perished a thousand years ago, triggering the extinction of all life. She showed me how it was reborn. A little outcast girl, ignorant of her own importance. Through her, I learned that life was only saved through a technological miracle. Zero Dawn. A terraforming system composed of nine subordinate functions. Each playing its part to reshape Earth from a barren rock to a lush landscape. Tended and protected by the machines. And with her, I learned the deepest secret of them all. The secret of her birth. That she is a clone of Elizabeth Subek, Zero Dawn's creator. Born to prevent a new extinction. Driven by Hades, a malevolent AI. Given sentience by a mysterious signal of unknown origin. And with a little help from me. She prevailed in a great battle at the city of Meridian. Becoming a champion for all humankind. But as useful as she has been, now... I must leave her behind. For as she strives to put right what Hades sundered, I have made a new discovery. One that heralds both destruction and opportunity. Oh yeah. <laughs> All right. So, welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West. We are about to start a new game. So without further ado, let us begin. Should we do normal? Yeah, I think we did normal in the playthrough for uh, Horizon Zero Dawn. So we'll probably choose a normal one. I did go through and play an ultra hard and tried to <clears throat> get 100% completion. I'm still working on that. I think I'm at like 89 or 91% or something like that. Uh, it should tell me exactly. Uh, maybe in the next video. <laughs> but yes, without further ado, let us begin on normal. Uh, minimal HUD information. Look at the world to find your way or a guided markers and icons on the screen to assist you on your journey. I normally would probably choose guided. Let's let's go ahead and go with guided. I know. I'm not a true gamer. <laughs> I don't care. 
I just play to have fun. Earth, the far future. Ooh, that went away quick. Look at how beautiful that is. We are going to die so many times. So nice. I'm running out of time, Elizabeth. The land is dying. People are suffering. Soon, they'll starve. All because of a terraforming system that's spiraling out of control. And only I can fix it. Only I have your genetic code. It won't be long before we hit the point of no return. And then, extinction. I've been searching for months for what I need. A backup of Gaia, the AIU designed to control the system. But every time I think I have a lead, it comes to nothing. Incredible. And every night, I have the same dream. I'm walking under a brilliant night sky, through a field of flowers. And when I arrive at the center, I see you, Elizabeth. Waiting for me, even though you've been dead for a thousand years. You're the closest person I've ever had to a mother. For a moment, I feel whole. But it never lasts. Oh. Beautiful. I'm always left alone. This world is your legacy, Elizabeth. I won't let it slip away. The valley below is my only remaining lead. My last hope to find the backup. I'll do whatever it takes to get it. I promise. Varl? <laughs> if it isn't Aloy, the savior of Meridian, and he grew up. You know I hate being called that stuff. Well, consider it a punishment for running out on us the very same night we beat Hades. I grew up an outcast. Remember, I'm not much for parties. Yeah. But that one was in your honor. Just saying. So, what are we doing? Must be urgent since you left so fast. Delving into ancient ruins? Or maybe it has something to do with the Blight? Both, actually, but, um... I, I should... Oh, no. I've been tracking you a long way. It's okay. 
After everything you've done to help Lenora and my family, I swore an oath to help you, no matter what. But you're stuck with me now. Like bark on wood. Okay, but if you're going to come with me, you'll need to be able to see what I see. <sighs> A focus? Never thought I'd get your second sight. I'll give you another one later and show you how to back up your data. Data? Information on the device. We've got a lot to cover. Um, I'll have to explain everything as we go. You see like this all the time? Since I was a little girl. Come on. Shall we? We shall. <laughs> All right, I got a couple of scrapes on the way here. We should find some medicinal plants, stock up. So it's time for your first lesson with the focus. Sounds good. Let's get started. All right. Reach for the stars. Gather These medicinal sky bush. Gather medicinal the berries. Helps you see the ones we need. There, those plants by the stream should do the trick. All right. Let's get all these. Okay. And then tap Q. Bitter? Yeah, well, at least they make you feel better. All right, we should keep going. Might want to grab more of these plants along the way. Definitely. Yeah, good idea. Go to the ancient ruins. Where are we going? That way. Okay. Those ruins. That's where we need to go. I don't want to put these ropes here, but see a few ways we can use the line to slide down. Yeah, we'll take all that. A few supplies. What are we after exactly? The backup? Well, um, it's an AI. It's, um, it's hard to explain. Think of it like a set of instructions that can fix the world. Box. Salvaging machine carcasses as usual. <laughs> and there they go. Looks like they left a carcass behind. Sorry about that. Game crashed. So let's get back to it. A lot of arrows in that machine. Better take a closer look. Someone took down this machine recently. Who else is coming? Driftwood over there. We better craft some arrows of our own. There might be trouble ahead. Good thing we already picked up some ridgewood. All right. Now to craft some arrows. There we are. Done. Me too. 
Arrows ready. Oh, careful. Okay, where are we going? There's a ladder. There it is. But can't reach it from here. Nothing a well placed arrow can't knock free. Just have to get the it. lock. There we go. For you. By the God. I found. Didn't say. Only that a backup might be here. We need to find a way in. So, um, what happened after I left Meridian? Well, there was a fuss when people realized you were gone. But then some of us figured you only would have left if it were for something important. You were right about that. Let's gather us up some Ridgewood here. Huh? See. There's definitely that up there, but I don't think we can knock it, bring it down from that. Looks like only after we get up there can we get it. So, I have a feeling we're going to need a lot of this. Gold thorn pepper. Down this way. Some medicinal berries. Uh oh. That's definitely new. Those dead machines have it on alert. How do you want to handle it? The focus can help us. We can scan the machine before we make our move. Okay. All right. So, have V to hold V to activate focus Give mode. There we go. Okay. See how parts of it are glowing? Those are its weak spots. Got it. Use Z and X to scroll through the machine components. Tap V to exit. Okay. Contains valuable resources destroyed when killed. He upgrade resource on that. It's I. It's a weak spot. Right. Indestructible. Okay, concentrate. Nice. I'll take that all. Another one's coming. Ooh. There we go. How does the focus know all that? It reads data on the machine. Like a hunter studying its prey? Yeah, kind of. I see another ladder. Looks like it's stuck. So after the fuss over me leaving, what did everyone else do? Well, as soon as the celebration was over, my mother led the rest of the Nora home. The Sun King put his people to work rebuilding the city. And I set out to find you. All right. Ladder, he said. Okay. You said you got to focus since you were a 
child, right? Yeah. Found my first one when I fell into a ruin. Got the others from an old cache not long ago. It's good to have extras. We'll be okay, Varl. Through here. Just in case we die and we need to get back up. Welcome to the Far Zenith launch facility. Far Zenith? I, I know they made some tech trades with Zero Dawn, but why would they have a backup of Gaia? Please register with reception for the tour. I guess they want us to check in with them? Please hold for identity scan. Access denied. Please wait here for personnel to assist you. Dr. Sobek. Okay. I guess they weren't on great terms with Elizabeth. <laughs> well, let's find a way in. Please hold for identity scan. Access denied. Credentials not recognized. I, I should be able to pry this open. There we go. There's climbing gear. Guess someone dropped in from above. Whoever left this here might have also shot those machines we found earlier. So where are they now? A good question. Ugh. What's that stench? We must have come here to Dell for scrap. Acid. That explains the smell. And it looks like something big came in from above. Crashed right through the camp. And through the wall. I should take a look at the rubble in that gap. Examine the rubble. Whatever came through here brought this down as it went out. If I can dislodge some of the debris, we might be able to squeeze through. Maybe I can find something to help in the camp. Aloy, over here. I think I got something. Okay. It's some kind of Osram prototype, I think. This hook looks like it can latch onto things. And this gear pulls it back. Hmm. It looks broken, but maybe we can repair it. Hook it to the debris. And pull it out. That could work. The focus can help us search the camp and identify anything we can use to fix the tool. My focus picked up a couple of things to check out. Poor guy. Acid burned right through his armor. A lot of supplies here. I guess they plan to stay a while. Part of a machine could help fix the gears. I wasn't sure if it was one of those things that... Let's 
Sparrow. Oh, over there. Machine cable. Stronger than rope. All right, I think I have what I need to repair the tool. Or maybe even make something better. You could use this workbench. All right. Crafting complete pull caster. Excellent. There, a uh, pull caster. Now to test it on the debris. Okay. I don't remember. But since we're here, how do I craft? Uh, skills, quest, notebook. Ammo. There we go. How do we craft? Okay. Doesn't seem like any of the buttons are doing it. Woo! I don't know what that was, but that was kind of cool. Um. Night. Nope. There we go. Well, it doesn't look like there's an okay. easy way out of here. I should scan the area. We have to find a way to keep going. Huh. What's this thing for? Pleasure to introduce you to Far Zenith. This didn't turn up much. I Forget what you think you know about us. Our truth is simple. We say reach for the stars, even if you have to cross 8.6 light years of space to get there. Please proceed into the auditorium, where we'll unveil our plans. Wonder what's in this auditorium. Guess we'll find out. We came from that way. Looks like we need to go that way. I'm guessing. Scan the area. Oh, I might be able to get up there. Grapple point. Okay. Ooh, that wow. was kind of neat. That works. 
That pole caster's useful. Too bad there's only one. Don't worry, I'll find you another way up. Tap L to left shift to sprint. Ooh, I did not read that. Oof, oof. There we go. Goodness. Okay, I gotta drop the ladder for Varl. There you go, Varl. Thanks. Okay. Push the boundary as explorers, pioneers, trailblazers. And now Far Zenith is taking the next leap into the future. That's why we're proud to have resurrected the Odyssey. When our governments abandoned in orbit, Far Zenith will actualize in less than a decade. But that's only the beginning. When the ship is complete, we will send the Odyssey and her crew where no one's gone before. A serious system. There will create humanity's first off world colony. The Odyssey may take 300 years to reach it, but when we look up at the night sky, we'll know they're on their way. And in the words of our founder, the late Peter Chimbumbe, the truest form of immortality is data corrupt. <laughs> the playback stopped. The old ones could fly through the sky? Between the stars? Uh, well, sort of. Yes, <laughs> sort of. That ship, the Odyssey, it, it never made it to the other star. Something went wrong, and it blew up. Is that why Elizabeth gave them a backup of Gaia? For their colony? Error. Public presentation file corrupted. Member recruitment file available. Do you wish to reactivate? Yeah. Reactivate. Let's see what else they had to say. We all know the projections. Economic instability, new biocontagions, rampant AIs. How long before another catastrophe creates unacceptable risk for the world's elite? We here at Far Zenith believe, escape the inevitable. And so we reach for the stars. Now you've seen what we're building here. Infrastructure to support the Odyssey's construction. A state-of-the-art data center to facilitate rapid technological advancements. And you've seen how we're managing public perception. So invest and join us. Claim your birth on the Odyssey. Preserve your way of life beyond the concerns of Earth. Well, they were right about the world ending. I just didn't know how. Yet. So everything they said back there about the next step for humanity, it was all a lie. These people only cared about saving their own skin. Yeah, well, didn't work out for them in the end. Sure didn't. That Oswald guy mentioned a data center. There, the backup. 
It should be stored in there. Won't be able to swim across. I guess we'll have to find a way around. Come on. God, this game is gorgeous. I still can't believe the old ones could fly. They were capable of a lot of things. Good and bad. Sure seems like it. I wonder what it's like up there. Among the stars. Nice. Deeper into the creepy ruin we go. What is that? What is that thing? I think we can look at those up soon. Keep your guard up. Oh, my guard is up. <laughs> Mine too. To say the least. <coughs> it's hard to breathe around this stuff. Up here. More of those. Careful. Don't want those things to call in some friends from underground. You take the left one. I'll deal with the one on the right. Okay. Just sneak up on okay, it. here goes nothing. Can't let it see me. Up a rock. Let's get it first. Check its patrol path. In position. Ready to move. Okay. There's its patrol path. I gotta get closer and stay out of sight. down too more of those machines ahead nothing really I can't handle All right. I'll take all that. I hear more. right there.
Got them all. I've been meaning to mention. I noticed you have a new look these days. <laughs> yeah, I know. Didn't have a lot of time to shave when I was trying to catch up to you. Don't worry, it's not permanent. Good. Sorry my whiskers offend you, anointed. Looks like the Blight's made its way in here. Looks like this little guy got caught up in the Blight. I couldn't escape. I hope it didn't suffer long. The Osram must have used explosives against the machines. They managed to get a couple. Looks like there was a barricade here. The machines must have broken through. I'll keep this for later. Guess that Osram yeah, we will. had a chance to use it. Careful. Traps ahead. Huh. Might be able to disarm them. There. Managed to salvage some supplies. And not blow it. yourself up. And got more supplies. Looks like another camp. While we're here, maybe we can make some traps of our own. Might come in handy against machines. Good idea. Hold R to open your hunter's kit and navigate to the blast trap. All right. Oh, I don't have the right supplies to craft a trap, but it looks like the Osram shot off some machine parts. I might be able to scrounge up enough materials from them. Okay. I can use this. Okay. I should have what I need to craft a trap. There. Explosive trap made. If anything walks into one of those, it won't know what hit it. Okay. How do we lay it down? Search the agent rooms for backup. Thumb and tap. Weak points are. Maybe we could place one of those traps you made in its path. I don't know. Uh, tap. Z and X to select the blast trap and then R to lay it down. I'll have to wait for it to go.
here. He's coming. We're clear. All right. Their secrets, but every place is different. All right, now we need to go up, it looks like somehow. There we go. picking up out there yeah and they're getting stronger and more frequent so the storms the blighted lands the rivers and lakes choked with algae you were born to fix all that yeah but i can only do it if i find that backup i think we're winding our way around to the data center we'll need to cut through that big building mm. this data mentions the tech that far zenith traded with zero dawn doesn't explain how they got a backup. I'll keep an eye out for more data. Looks like we've got to climb up. Whoa. This place is really falling apart. Well, it is a thousand years old. Looks like some kind of meeting room. Activated. The Zero Dawn terraforming system, the brainchild of Dr. Elizabeth Sobek, empowered by nine subordinate functions, Gaia, the core of the system, is capable of advanced planetary engineering, an obvious advantage to our space colonization efforts. Operation Phase One. Establish an asset within Project Zero Dawn. Status complete. Phase two, the asset will secretly beamcast a complete copy of Gaia and her subordinate functions to this facility's data center. If all goes well, Zero Dawn staff will remain completely unaware of the transmission. Risks. Discovery of this operation could result in Zero Dawn withholding the already negotiated Apollo database. Special care must be taken not to alert Travis Tate, the expert hacker in charge of Hades Protocol. 
In addition, extreme caution must be exercised in regards to Dr. Sobek herself. As one of the world's preeminent technologists, she may have instituted unforeseen security measures. A complete assessment is attached. This concludes the executive summary. I thought Elizabeth sent the backup here, but she didn't. Well, Zenith stole Gaia. Aloy, why does that woman look like you? Uh, um, it's okay, Paul. We look alike because we're the exact same, genetically identical. But she was one of the old ones. How can you be her? Because I wasn't born, I was made by a machine. It's why I'm motherless, why I was cast out as an infant. I don't understand. What kind of machine can make a person? Remember when I said the backup is like a set of instructions? It's more than that. It's called Gaia. And for a long time, she cared for the world until she had to destroy herself. So she made me to bring her back. I'm the only one who can. And this place is my last hope. You once said the goddess spoke to you when you went into All Mother Mountain. Was that this Gaia? Yes, but she's not the goddess, Laurel. There isn't one. How can you be sure? It sounds like she anointed you with a sacred task. I've had a lot of time to figure this out. And you will too, with the focus. But for now, the report said they were going to store the stolen copy of Gaia in the data center. So that's where we have to go. Okay? Okay. Huh. <clears throat> Look at that. Aloy, over here. I found something you could use. I'm sure you did, buddy. But this is where we're going to end this video. Can't help them. So I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit that like button. If you're new around here, please subscribe. And until next time, I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. I think this is better off in your hands.